All right. Hey, everyone. Welcome to the stream. How are you guys doing today? Hope y'all are having a fantastic day. I know I certainly am. Ellen, welcome. Tony, Zangari, Yambi, Hello, Erica, Amazon. Hi, guys. So excited to see you here. Hope you guys are doing really well. All righty. This week's dungeon, guys, is the Offering Chambers. Um, have you been naughty or nice? It is an easy difficulty ice dungeon. But that being said, there are no less than six axical traps and six ice jump traps. Uh, but only two rooms, and they are easy. So there is that. Loot this week is the tech chest piece, the Mosasaur tech saddle, the flak chest piece, and the tech rifle. Pretty good. I am going to go ahead and grab my stamina buff. Because that's a lot of running we're going to have to do. There's a lot of loot crates today. <laughs> Let's go. I love it. Dara, how's it going? Isan, does anybody else have midterms or just you? No, I'm pretty sure a lot of people have had midterm exams. Um, at least the ones I've been talking to. All right. Still no floor textures. It's a little sad. Um, All right, let's go ahead and grab the loot crates off of the entrance area. One here and one directly across the other side. And then I think I'm going to do the bows of the present first. Makes it a little easier. Might as well get a little extra. A little extra water. Okay, so... We're already here. Is it this way? No, it's this way. I guess it doesn't matter. Okay. Okay. I heard a unicorn. There's unicorns this week. I almost forgot. I almost forgot that was a thing, but there are unicorns this week too, guys. It's a really good week. It's a really good dungeon. It's a lot of crates. Yes, it's a ton. It's a presence-shaped dungeon. It's um, it's just a lot of collecting loot crates. All right, we got some charcoal. Mm -hmm. We got this one. Also charcoal. We're going to come out with a lot of charcoal, I have a feeling. Let's see if we can find the unicorn, though. All right, got that. Dream and metal shield. All right, so that was the bottom part of the bow. All right, and here we are at the top bar. All right, so we're headed straight towards the featured loot. Right now, there are three traps between me and it. There's an axical trap, a wall trap, and an ice jump. Because the game is rude. Dun, dun, dun. That probably was an okay one to go. Not. No. No. Yes. Ooh, I'm a little close. Nope. Yes. Nope. Close enough. Okay. Good. We made it past trap number one. We have to make it out and back, which is great fun. Wall trap. Wall trap right here on the edge of the, the bow. Be careful. One. Five? Single tap. Just go again. Um, and now we have an ice jump. It's great. There's so many things. So very many things. Use that one. Uh, my gosh, that's a lot of crates. Uh, Cece, how's it going? What's the featured loot? Featured loot this week was a... Uh, Black chest piece, the tech rifle, I believe the Mosasaur tech saddle, and a tech chest piece. Too far, too far. No, 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 no. Okay, I saved it. I accidentally jumped twice. Oh no, it's blinking in and out of existence. I hate it. These are the worst. Okay, I didn't hit it. 
They never did fix that. Very unsettling. Um, all right, so now we'll be able to get our featured loot. Trap three of three. Ha ha. All right, we got ourselves a Mosasaur Tech Saddle. Pre-made, by the way. Which means that's worth a lot of element. Because you can disassemble those if you want. Tech saddles are kind of useless. Um, thank you, Redcore. You need a dungeon? This seems quite easy. Nice. Yeah, it's not bad. Other than all the traps, it's not bad. And even the traps are... Meh. They're okay. Izan, yes, there are unicorns in this dungeon. I can hear them. I do recall there being something like unicorns the last time I ran this dungeon, which was about a year ago. Uh, it's a pretty good little dungeon. All right. Gives you a lot of stuff. Go. Cool. Exicles. I didn't like that one. They weren't like together enough. There it is. Oh. Shaving my nose off. That's okay. Good enough. All right. We made it through that. Ooh, finally. Okay. We can go this way. And now we're back at the entrance area, which is beautiful. Um, let's go ahead and do the other side. Yeah, we'll go to the other side of the bow. So much loot. I got a dire wolf rug. That's nice. That's pretty good. All right, if we go all the way around this way, we will get the tech building piece. Equus. There are also equus in the halls. Not just unicorns, also equus. Uh, do the dungeons always have the same dinos? No, they are different every time. They are almost never the same. I'm looking for that unicorn. I'm going to find him. There are a lot of repeat creatures, but they're in different combinations and such. Alright, so this should be the... Yep, tech light. Ooh, that's one of my favorites. Okay. The tech light is really good, guys. Like, it's just awesome. It's such a good light. I really need to put them up all over my base. Oh, this is such a long run back. Yeah, such a long run back. Okay. Hey, you. Goodbye, you. Doo -doo. Um, you really need a female unicorn so you can breed? Ooh, yes. Would recommend. All right, so we are going to do the entire right side of the dungeon map now. Um, they're in three distinct sections. There's right, center, and left, obviously. You got to do the right side first. That's where the facility key is. Can you not? You could do the center first, technically. I'm going to do this side first, because... I didn't like that. I liked that. Okay. So it's guarded by an axical trap this whole side. 
But then it's just a very long loot run with a little room at the end. Large woven rug. Very nice. We're going to get a lot of rugs today because there's a few premium chests in this dungeon. Worth running if you can do the traps. Finally got your thoroughbred unis. Oh my gosh. Aren't they amazing, Ellen? Spikes. All right. This way. There's a room here. All right, my stamina boost is about to run out, which is a bummer. All right, adaptogenic serum, lovely. Oh, there's so many. I forget which way to go. Um, right, it's a giant square. So I can go either way to get to these. Um, I'm going to go do the other side first and then come back because there are two ice traps on either side of the two ice traps here, basically, on either side of these two loot crates. And I do want them, but I'm going to go do the easy stuff first. Maybe throw up a save after just in case. Ice traps are pretty good at uh, messing me up. All right. Yep, we're going to go grab this one. This should be the facility key. If all you're interested in is element, go get you the featured loot. Go get you the facility key and just backtrack pretty quick. I think you only have to do one event room to get to the boss. It's pretty good, and it's not a hard event room. It's Wooly Rhino, so it's not easy, but it's not hard. Maybe it is easy. I forget. I got stone. So many water rooms. It's so helpful. Megaloceros. All right, we'll grab this one. Chris, that's pretty good. You must have worked pretty hard on yours. Do you remember the 450 spawning you tamed on your brutal save? Well, something happened. What happened? That doesn't sound good. What happened? All right, guys. First event room. Here it is. One of two. It's a dodo room. This would actually be a very good room for a no Ingram or yeah, no Ingrams, no Ingrams. Cuz uh you could beat these guys with like a good pike. You wouldn't have to use a gun. The rhinos maybe you could do with a sword actually. If you're doing a no Ingrams run, I recommend this dungeon. In fact, this might be quicker. I'll get a bit more. But that's not the end of the world. Nice. We're starving. That's not nice. You could use a sword in this room as well.
Okay. There. Now my character feels a little better. Um, orient myself. I want to go this way. Um, can we tame the unicorn in the dungeon, or do you have to revive it? You do have to revive tame it. You can't tame anything in the dungeon, so you'd have to kill it and then revive it off, um, out of the dungeon. It is worth doing, uh, in some cases, because, you know, unicorns are pretty hard to find sometimes. And this is like a guaranteed unicorn, which is nice. All right, this way. Oh my goodness, uh, Verbased, thank you so much for the follow. Super appreciate it. Sub? Sub. Thank you so much for the sub. Super appreciate it. Forgot what platform I was on for a second. It's okay. We're on the YouTubes. That's a sub. Thank you. Super appreciate it. Welcome to the channel. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Do, do, do. Scott, hello. Yes, we are. We are having a fantastic day so far. Going well. Oh, I got a chair. This is definitely a No Ingram's dungeon. Oh my goodness, the chair is a game changer. Um, because you can go fishing. I need to run this on my No Ingram's game. See if I may make it through the Wooly Rhino room and the Dodic boss. I guess. A little, little nerve wracking. Uh, is there a sound lag happening? Crazy. Yes, the sound is just a little bit behind my gameplay. That's, um, ever since I had to get a new capture card, I've not been able to figure out how to fix that. It's, uh, annoying, <laughs> to say the least. I am bothered by it. Constantly. The Amber to revive is ridiculous. Yeah. The Amber to revive a unicorn is a lot. It's not as bad as a griffin, though. Alrighty. We have not one, but two ice traps to get through. I'm gonna throw up a save. Because I know myself. And I'm familiar with Ark. And it's not a lava trap, but it's close enough. <laughs> Need to read an army of unicorns. They're so good. That's the thing, though, right? Like, once you revive the one... You'll never need another one. Like, well, once you revive two, a male and a female, you'll never need another one because you can breed for stats and stuff, so it's good. Um, that works. Oh my gosh, it's fully visible. It's a miracle. It's a holiday miracle, guys. There we go. Get that one. An Ascendant Pike. Hold up. No, okay. I was like, there's no way it's better than my current Pike, right? And it's not. I was correct. All right, an Adaptogenic Serum. Lovely. All right, then we got to go through this guy. Very slow. I don't want to jump and do something dumb. I don't like that. You weren't there and then suddenly you're there. It's very upsetting. All right, cool. So that's, uh, that's that whole side of the dungeon. We have... Yeah, we've done it. We've done the thing. Good. Go back to the starting room now. Well, which means we have to do another axe trap. I don't like that. How do you tame a spino? You trap it because otherwise it'll run away from you. Or like me, you just run after it with something that's faster than the spino, i.e. like a griffin. Um, and you shoot it with a lot of trank arrows until it goes out. You give us some fishy meats, I believe. 
I would give it both because I always forget if it only eats fish meat or if that's just like the berry or what. I'd give it both fish meat and regular meat and see which one it prefers. Or look it up on Dodo Dex first. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. One third of the dungeon completed. We did good, guys. We did good. Okay. Now we got to do the center bit. Uh, Starting here. Again, it's a lot of loot crates. I'm just going to start, start going through them. One. A Mastercraft torch. Very nice. Yeah, there's two this way. Stone and a Senate Kite and Gauntlets. All right. Gravel half pavers. Okay. All right. So this is the way to the facility door and some other stuff. So I'm going to skip that. Oh, man. I'm going to get so lost this way. Yeah. Let's do this one first because it dead ends. This is the last one. I forgot about that. All right. There's an ice jump in the way. It's so cold. We need so much food. All right. There's a loot crate down here. It is guarded by this uh, lovely little ice jump trap. Dreaming riot leggings. Not really worth it, but you know, you never know what you're going to find. Could have been free bullets, which might have been worth it. Up. Down. There we go. Okay. I don't trust that great. Alrighty, so that's that. Um, doo -doo -doo. Now we're going to go this way. Grab that. Five stone. There's so many loot crates, it's so hard to hit them all. I missed it. Rock half pavers, not the best premium, but a premium nonetheless. I'm like completely disoriented here. It gets very twisty in this bit. Yep, there's one here. But not one there. Okay. Herbivore pheromone. Oh, the whole dungeon just became worth it. Pheromones are great. I love them. All right. So there's axe traps uh, and a loot crate and then a couple more. And then we can go back and do all the ones right before the last boss room or the last, not boss room, the last dino room, event room. Call that good. I didn't like it. Nope. That was pretty good. I hesitated, but it's fine. That's pretty good. There's a horse somewhere in a lot of pain. All right, that's a journeyman wooden shield. Nope. Yes. Nope. Nope. 
Yes. Nope. Technically, yes, but no. All right. Okay, we did that. Ooh. Um, let's go get the center one, the big room. Apprentice Wooden Club. Still have not seen the unicorn. We'll find it eventually. It's got to be somewhere. And another axe trap. There's so many axe traps this week. There are six axe traps and six icicle jumps. And a fair few of them are back and forth. Mm-mm. I'll wait. Nope. Yes. Yes. Whew. All right. Two more loot crates down here. One. And then all the way past the penguins down there is two. Not worth it. Can the unicorn die without you killing it? Yes, it can die to a trap in the dungeon if it gets into a stupid place. Um, hopefully I would find it, but you never know. Sure, Hank, how's it going? Hope you're having a great day. Sano was killed by a rock that rendered while you're inside. Oh no. Oh, I hate when that happens. I've had that happen to me. The kill zones that are inside the glitching areas. It's terrible. But then you can just accidentally end up inside them if you go too fast. The deep dungeon is... Deep ocean is a dangerous place. That's what I meant to say. It did not come out that way. Not the first time. Mm -mm. No. Nope. Not quite. Yeah. Nope. Yes. Okay. Whew. Finally. All right. I think that's everything. Then we can... Uh... Yeah, now we can head back up. This way. Pretty sure I got everything on this part. Uh, Arvin, thank you so, so much for the super chat. Super appreciate it. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. You're amazing. Thank you so much. I hope you're having a fantastic day, and I hope you're really enjoying the stream. This one. Ooh. And there's the notification. I was ahead of the notification. <gasps> there it is. There it is. I see the... It's 128 Ember. That's not that bad for a 150. For a max level. That's not that bad. Um, well worth grabbing, though. I'll tell you what. All right, so we're going to go this way and do the loot crates. Why are you here? Go away. He was in the way. He was causing problems. All right. Oh, I finally know which symbiote I'm supposed to be using. There's one that's a little bit less with whatever than the other. All right. Got to go down this way. There are two, three loot crates beyond this. Three loot crates beyond this. There's that and an axicle trap. I don't want to stand on the vent.
go, go, go. One. Nope. I missed it. Never mind. Not one. Anytime. Thank you. Thank you, Arvind. Um, how did Avon die by a rock? Uh, Jose, there are a few rocks in the ocean that are not supposed to be rocks you can get inside, um, but there are some issues with them where they are a little glitchy, and if you're going fast enough, you render, the rock doesn't render in until you're inside of where it's supposed to be, but because those are also common meshing areas, the devs turned them into kill zones, so anything that's inside those will automatically just die, like gone, you cannot get it back, it's dead forever. Um, to prevent the meshing. Problem is, <laughs> problem is, you can just hit those accidentally if you're traveling fast enough. Um, yeah, it's unfortunate. It's not a good time. I've lost a Basilo and a Mosa to them before, I believe. I had another one where it killed me, but it didn't kill the thing I was on, and I was able to... I had to, like, request it out. It was really funky. Because it was stuck in the rock, and I couldn't get it back because I couldn't de-render the rock to get it out without killing it. I'm focusing. I'm focusing. There we go. Nope. Yeah. Woo! Okay. Journeyman long neck rifle. Woo! Bikes. You know, the funny thing is the traps take so long and the loot crates give you so little um, time boost in comparison that the timer on this is actually a little tough for blitz weeks I should have gone nope nope Nope. Nope. There it is. Okay. Ooh, we did that. Okay, finally. All right, so that's the loot crates here. We've done them all. Let's head on to the last little bit of the dungeon. So, exci so excited. I choked. It's okay. Don't worry. Um, it's early. I haven't learned how to talk yet for the day. It's a new process every day. I have to learn, reteach myself how to speak like a human. All right. There we go. Mm, beautiful. You and your favorite dolphin died on a rock? Yep. I'm not surprised by that. I'm saddened by it, but not surprised. Apprentice Plessy. All right, here we go. Finally, the facility gate. Woo. All right, and finally, at long last, uh, dungeon room number two, two of two. What's the most common unicorn spawn? Azan, I have the easiest time finding them in the Redwoods, but they really can spawn anywhere. Willy Rhino. Whoo! This room would hurt if I didn't have this. Oh, you're still alive. Heck. Heck. Ow. I love it when my shots don't count. Mate boosted is rude.
Yeet. Oh, one of those is gonna hit me. There we go. Ah! No thanks. Okay. So we did that. Threat's been cleared. All done. Finished. Okay. Um. Alright, now it's a bunch of loot crates. Grab that. Oh, so many potent medical brews. I like it. Yep, two over here. Send it for boots. And more potent medical brews. I'm really loving how many medical brews I'm getting. It's lovely, actually. Wow. Got like a little collection going. Is that Ascendant Moza Platform Saddle? Is that what I saw? That's not bad. Charcoal. There are so many. That's a pretty chest. That must be premium. It is. It's a toy paddle ball. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I love when I get things that I can raise griffins with. That's all I use them for is griffins. Toys are worthless for anything that's not a griffin, in my opinion. Is that maybe a giga? They might be useful for a giga. Alright, charcoal. Alright guys, we have one last axicle trap and one last ice jump to do in this dungeon. Technically, the last ice jump is optional. And it doesn't even guard like a very good loot crate. I just like to be a completionist about my dungeons. Mm -mm, didn't like it. No, no. No. Yes. Mm-mm. It's just a little off. Nope. Yes. That works. Okay. Whew. All right, that's it for that. The unicorn has respawned. I can hear it. Ah, an equus. All right, that's the boss teleporter right here. Beautiful. I'm going to go do the ice trap and get myself that last loot crate. Hello, pretty equus. Go that way. Good job. He did exactly what I wanted him to. There's one more loot crate. We have to pick up. No. What are you doing? I, that was not a jump, you stupid game. I just started, like, floating toward the edge. Weird. Weird, and I didn't like it. All right. That's it. Ascendant Riot Leggings. I doubt it. I highly doubt it. Oh. Oh, 1457 armor, you say? 1817 Dura, you say? Oh. Um. I'm saving my game in case I die right now. <laughs> I want those riot pants, guys. They're actually really good. Compared to what I currently wear, those are pretty darn good. Do we need wings for this dungeon? 
Not technically. The wings do help a lot. Um, if you if you do those at a run, I don't think you need the wings. I just really prefer to have them because then I can do them at a walk and it's very controlled of a jump. It's not just me um, doing that. Whoa! Never mind, I forgot I had the wings on. It's not just me taking a, a running jump at it. Because you can clear those without uh, the wings. I just find them helpful. I prefer the wings. Alrighty. That was scary. I almost yeeted myself into the uh, abyss. Um, okay. So. I don't need that. It's heavy. I really don't need all that, but whatever. Um... Eat a little food. We're fine there. Our armor's looking like it's in pretty good shape. Let's start the weekly pursuit. Get our bonus element. Beautiful. Uh, I technically just saved, so I'm just gonna go ahead and hop in. It is a Dodic boss, guys. In his proper arena. He's not the remix. Ow. Ow. There we go. Boy, he's loud. Stop rolling. on his left side because he is um, he has the same problem as all Dodix have is that they can't hit you when you're on their left they only swing right they have some issues that they probably need to work through it's fine why why sudden sudden quiet Oh, so close. Really? There it is. Beautiful. His tail got very sad when he died. A little crooked. Oh, his little feet. Uh. Alrighty. That was it, guys. That's the whole dungeon. It's pretty good. It's a fun one. My old wooden hut. It's all dark now. It's great. It's good stuff. Um, anyway, also, there are free items, apparently. I got an Ascendant Hide shirt. That's cool. That's cool. I'll take it. Um, but yeah, lots of good stuff this week. Uh, plenty of premium items. I'm counting six. Seven. And then I had an Herbivore Pheromone. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Seven. Seven premium items. Um, not to mention this lovely unicorn implant, which is fantastic. Pretty big deal. And then uh, only about half of these are from this dungeon. This onward. The Moza Tech Saddle on. So not bad. Uh, did get Ascendant Riot Leggings that are actually really good. So that's fantastic. Got a couple other things that are not so great, but it's all right. 
That's actually a good Ascendant Flak Helmet. That's actually a really good Ascendant Flak Helmet. How did I miss that I picked that up? That's better than what I have now. That's okay. That's really good. Wow, guys, run this week's dungeon. If nothing else, you're you're going to get some decent loot. Um, decent armor. On top of all those premiums. If you can get through all the traps, well worth it. Highly recommend. Go to, guys. Go forth and conquer this two-room dungeon. It's a... Uh, it's a holiday one, and they definitely were kind to us this year. <laughs> we had the good luck on the presents. So, yeah. Uh, thank you guys all so much for watching. Hope everybody has a fantastic holiday season. Next stream is theoretically on Christmas Day on Sunday, hopefully, if that works out. But uh, my plan is to be streaming. We'll see if I can make that work. It may be a little late because of events, but we're going to see what we can do. All right, guys, please remember to hit the like button on your way out. It seriously does help me out. And if you want to see more content like this, you guys can, of course, subscribe. And I am going to go ahead and catch you all in the next one. Signing off. This is the Iguana. <laughs>